At the beginning of the 15th century, Europe has already suffered several plague epidemics, which brought death to one quarter of its inhabitants. A protracted war between England and France rages in its western part. In the east, Turkish conquerors are penetrating into the continent, and they will gradually take over the entire Balkan Peninsula. Local Christian population is being sold into slavery, and in conquered areas, Islam is solidifying its dominance using the carrot and stick method. Deaths are piling up, and many a preacher is predicting the approaching end of the world and the arrival of Antichrist. In these hard times, people are turning to the church for solace. But church dignitaries, instead of tending to their own souls and those of their flock, are living in lavish luxury, selling indulgences and amassing possessions. Despite proclaimed vows of celibacy, they often keep concubines and advance their own illegitimate children. Never-ending conflicts between secular and church powers culminate in the appointment of two popes. Both of them are unequivocally convinced of their own legitimacy. Religious storms are starting to ravage Europe. Preachers and scholars criticize the moral decay of the church. Among them is the rector of the university in Prague, Jan Hus. He calls the Pope the Antichrist, and in retaliation, the Pope labels Jan Hus a heretic and excommunicates him. Jan Hus is invited to a council in Constance, where he is eventually sentenced for his opinions and burned at the stake. Instead of his doctrine disappearing, he becomes a martyr in the eyes of his followers. A movement is born, and it quickly gains widespread support in Bohemian lands, both among the common people and the burgesses and nobility. Its members call each other brother and sister. This symbol is the chalice, as one of the demands for reformation, communion under both kinds, which is the expression of equality between the clergy and lay persons. Following the death of his brother, Sigismund of Luxembourg is to be crowned the King of Bohemia. The Hussites, however, blame him for the death of Jan Hus and insist that he first accepts their reformation demands. But Sigismund refuses to accept these conditions and travels to Wroclaw, where he begins to prepare a crusade. The Hussites gradually conquer Catholic castles and towns in Bohemia, and to the surprise of entire Europe, they are victorious against all crusades against them as well. Then they go on the offensive. At the beginning of the year 1428, they storm into Silesia through the Moravian Gate. Hey look, Rosdorf is in sight now. We're getting close. Brother Hinek, Brother Prokop sends a message that you should join him and the other commanders at the head of the army. Tell him I'll be there shortly. Straw, you're in charge. Of course, go on.
Did you send for me, Brother Prokop? Ah, here he is. Brother Blazak will tell you about our plans. Blessed be the Lord, brothers. So let us repeat it once more for Hinek. The army will split up behind the village. The main part with Brother Prokop will continue on towards Osablaha and then towards Glogorek, where as far as we know, Count Bolko still resides. Brother Doberslav with his people, and you, Hinek, with yours, will set off from Rohrersdorf for Hennersdorf, and then further on, all the way to Zuckmantel. From the other side, Otto with his foot soldiers will go through a Hermannstadt, and you will join together by Edelstein Castle. And what about the castle? Conquer? Only if it's easy. It won't harm Bishop in any way, but there will be enough of you there. Keep in mind that we are still only at the gates of Silesia. There will be plenty of time for waging war. Don't take any unnecessary risks. Take only what you can easily transport and burn the rest. Everything clear? Clear. clear. All right, you're dismissed. And brothers, may Christ be with you. And with you, brother. Good luck. Do you hear? It's already started. We will meet behind the village. Don't stay there much. We still have a lot of work to do. I'll find the guys and we'll follow you right away. All right then, Brother Hinek. For now, go with God. Here! Hiding straw. Draw. Hinek, look what we have here. Local hero. <laughs> leave, leave me alone, heretics, devils! Leave him. May he go to the devil. Well, what's new with Prokop? Grab your things, jump onto the wagons and we're off. Pukala is waiting for us behind the village. Do we have to go with the poles? Shut up and hurry. Where is Father Divish? Maybe he went off somewhere to take a piss. Uh, oh, there he is. Well, didn't you hear? Pack up your junk and we're off to plunder with the poles. Wenzel, you go grab the others. Where are we off to, Brother Hinek? We will join up with the poles and go towards Hennersdorf. In whose dwarf it is. Onwards.
There they come. Everyone up, we're off. I'm looking forward to fighting by your side, Hinek. To Hennersdorf! We're here! Charge them, brothers! Pier Pritzig Bratscha! For the truth and the greater glory of God Almighty! Yeah. me what the hell Brother, here! Here you go. Take these torches. Spread the red rooster to the other houses as well.
You shouldn't have done that. It's done, Brother Dobyaslav. It's getting dark, we should start thinking about where we're going to camp. We're too exposed here. We should find a safer place, somewhere near Yarostorf or Peterstorf. The night will be lit by fire. Dratovudsa! Dratovudsa! Smoke! In the west! Hmm. Really? It's in the direction of Yanisdorf. None of the brothers were supposed to be there, were they? They were not. The only things that should be on fire around here are things that we set fire to ourselves. Get out of there, you swine! Get out of there! Heretics! God will punish you all with his merciless hand! God is already punishing, and as his instrument, we punish all who do not live according to God's law. Leave me alone! I know the bishop himself! You will regret this, you monsters of hell! For whilst they trust in idols which are without life, though they swear amiss, they look not to be hurt. No, but for please, two things they alone. shall be justly punished, because they have thought not well of God giving heed to idols, and have sworn unjustly in guile despising justice. Stay for it is me, not the power of them you, by whom me. they swear, but the just vengeance of sinners always punisheth the transgression of the unjust. Brother Hinek, take your people, get the horses, and go there. If the bishop's people are coming from the west, we must be prepared. Maybe it's the soldiers of Elderstein Castle. The devil knows how much the crew Conrad left there. Just take a look, and come right back. We'll finish up here in the meantime, and get ready to march. Understood. Father, get on your horse. We're going west. All right, I'm right behind you. Hey, Hinek, hurry up. It's going to be dark. Brother Hinek, come on already, we don't have much time.
Hey, Straw, back into the saddles. We're heading west. We've seen smoke. Of course. On your horses, men. We're heading out. Everything is scorched, but I don't see any bodies anywhere. Maybe the locals themselves? You'd think they'd set fire to their own village. And ran off. Maybe into the woods around the village. And they're watching us right now. But why would they set fire to it themselves? Look! To the west! More smoke! Let's go! Someone over there. Catch them. Here. We won't get any further like this. Dismount. Hey, Hinek! Slow down! Wait for us! It might be a trap! find a different way. No. Go back to Pukala. Tell him what happened. Bring the others here. All right. But be careful, Hinek. Everyone back. Let's go. Quickly. Damn it. What now? Can't even see the tip of my own nose. Oh, I'm going to twist my ankle in here. That's better. It's damp here, and I smell decay in the air. I'm sure those three sons of bitches are around here somewhere, and they'll jump at me from the shadows.
Damn it. My boots will get soaked through. Fucking hell! That startled me! What kind of strange lights are those? Should I go towards them? Where are you taking me, light? Where the hell does this lead? I have no idea where I am. Haven't I already been here? I feel like I'm going in circles. So you're fairy lights, and you're trying to lead me astray. This way, or that one. Jesus Christ, there's more and more water here. Hopefully I'm out of the maze now, but this doesn't look like the way out. What's this? Torches on the wall, where am I? Thank you. 
damn it! Who are you? Whom do you serve? You shouldn't have come here, Hussite. Now you will die. All right, all right. Where is that last scoundrel? Hmm, the cave's blocked. But the path led here and it was used until recently. It can't have been here for long. Me. What the hell is this? Locked. strange mechanism which seems to function as a lock. There's a cross-shaped opening in the center. It's working. There's a hole on the floor. Oh, oh, hope it doesn't fall with me.
What are the levers used for? Let's see. Make it snappy. Take this too. Like that. Make sure it doesn't fall. You're a bunch of clumsy idiots you are. Forgive me, father. What was that? One of those heretics got inside. But I've already sent Karhart and Bogabu to take care of it. Caesar! Ego 
Sorry. 